the main aim of this experience is to think out of the box. By using this methodology, uh, you uh, can see how you can uh, stop projects that are not working before you spend too much money and by testing and piloting uh, you're gonna save money and resources uh, which is really important for NGOs. So we really have a look at different methodologies to use innovations uh, but besides I think the bigger innovation and disruptive ways of working also come up with a methodology how you can select projects and how you really can work in a methodological way of um, yeah, aligning projects towards your overarching strategy which is very fascinating. I think NGOs overall, um, in all the history of NGOs, all the path we already have been walked through, we already forget about our basics, and our basics is to try to solve in as easiest and efficient way our stakeholders' needs. Uh, this is the big question, how do we NGOs um, continue being relevant, precisely solving these needs? And innovation is, of course, a pathway in order to achieve this kind of dialogue and solution. It's time for me to have to deal with value that goes beyond economics and like uh, the market per se. It was a great workshop. It was really different uh, from many other workshops that I had. Uh, when we, for example, map the uh, business model of organizations, you have different values being exchanged, um, yeah. like investment, money, reputation, exposure. And here, when we saw people putting love or care as a value being transferred from organization to children, to beneficiaries, and it was also very useful because uh, together with the teams from, I think, seven countries, um, we mapped all their initiatives and did some portfolio mapping exercise. And we tried to see uh, the levels of maturity of projects and um, the horizon, so how complex they are, how much they're contributing to the organization's future. And um, I think all the teams uh, went home uh, with some key action points um, in order to restructure, adjust their portfolio and increase their efficiency. And also, um, I think we sort of uh, raised critical questions uh, on the bigger picture of the organization and its uh, future. Okay, thank you. Thank you.